Our next activity is A, and A is for art. One of the things we talk about a lot in art are colors. And if you look at a train, a Northern Central Railway of York train, you see there's many different kinds of colors. We have two kinds of colors. We have what are called primary colors. Primary colors would be colors like red and yellow and blue. But we also can mix up those primary colors to create what we call secondary colors. And you see a lot of secondary colors when you're on the train, not only on the train, but also all around the train as well. For this activity, you'll need three cups. And you notice what I did is I filled each one up about halfway with water. And then what you'll need is you'll need some colored craft sticks. And you can get this at a local hobby or craft or art store. Uh, Michael's in York is a good place to find these. And notice what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the red one. Red's a primary color. And I'm going to take the blue one. That's also a primary color. I'm going to stick them in this glass right here. Then I'm going to take two other primary colors. Okay, I've got yellow and I've got red. I'm going to put them in the second cup, just like this. And then the last one is I'm going to take blue and yellow. I'm going to put them in this cup right here. And what you want to do is you want to wait a couple of hours. Well, I've already done that hard work for you. And I'm going to move these over to the side and I'm going to bring out the cups that I started earlier today. Okay, And you'll notice that the first one, here's our red and blue. And what's the color inside the cup? It's a secondary color called purple. Two primary colors, yellow and red. We put those together in the cup and when they mix up we get another secondary color called orange. And then we take blue and yellow and magically when they go in there, they mix up and create the secondary color green. A lot of people think that green's a primary color. Uh -uh. It's a secondary color. It's blue and yellow mixed together. So you can create this. What would happen, do you think, if we put a blue, a red, and a yellow? What do you think would happen if we put two yellows and three reds? What do you think would happen if we put all the different colors that we can in one cup. What colors do you think we would create? Well, this is a neat activity. This will really impress your family and you can create all kinds of neat colors just with craft sticks and a little bit of water. That's it, boys and girls.